Hello everyone, in today's video I will be showing you how to make a bottle art that is rainbow bottle art. I am using embroidery thread here, you can even use woolen thread. So first take a bottle, see to it that the bottle is plain and clean the bottle to remove the sticker. You just have to soak the bottle in soapy water for like around 15-20 minutes. If you soak for long time, the sticker will come off very easily. So soak as long as possible. When you start doing this, see to it that the bottle is dry and it is also clean. And see to it that you take a plain bottle. And I have taken rainbow colored embroidery thread. You can even take woolen thread. Now let's start making it. First apply glue in the bottom of the bottle and start sticking the thread. Normally you can go on sticking and after sticking the first round you just have to wait for it to dry. As it is the first round the thread will come off when you continue sticking. So wait for it to dry then continue sticking. After it's dried you just have to continue sticking the thread. And see to it that you cover the bottle properly like the bottle shouldn't be visible here and there little it will be visible but that's fine but see to it that the bottle isn't visible much after sticking the thread it's your wish you can allow it to dry or you can just continue like that there is no problem if you continue just like that I didn't allow it to dry I have just continued and see to it that you don't touch the thread after sticking to the bottle because as you are working with the glue there are chances there might be stains in your hand so when you touch the thread without drying the stains in your hand will stick to the thread if you want to adjust some threads use scissors or something else instead of your hands and see to it that all the color threads are equal in length and it shouldn't be unequal if it's not equal the bottom art will look odd so see to it that the threads are equal in length and while rotating the bottle don't touch the thread part and rotate as it is not dried there are chances like the threads will get misplaced or the threads might get dirty so while rotating hold under the bottle and rotate and while sticking another color thread stick the thread and wait for like 15-20 seconds for it to dry then go on sticking as usual here I'm doing a rainbow pattern you can do any other pattern or stick any other color of your choice or you can do this pattern like sticking different shades of same color from darker shade to lighter shade or from lighter shade to darker shade for example take pink color try getting as many shades of pink as possible and stick from lighter shade to darker shade or you can just use one color and stick the whole bottle and at the end decorate it with some sequins or something like that. As I have already said you can use woolen thread if you don't have embroidery thread and it's all up to you how you want to design your bottle and you can put your ideas and make different patterns and after sticking the thread there will be excess glue don't rub it with your hands or something allow it to dry on its own and sticking the thread in this curve part of the bottle is gonna be a bit tricky it's kind of difficult you have to do it very slowly as it is curved the thread will come off very easily when you go on sticking so do it very slowly in other part of the bottle you can stick the thread fast and easily but in this part you, it's kind of difficult so you have to do it very slowly and before sticking the last thread allow the bottle to dry then start sticking the last thread because as it is the top part of the bottle you will have to hold the bottle in the place where you have stick the thread so before sticking the last part allow the bottle to dry like for 15-20 minutes then start sticking and the top part of the bottle the mouth part of the bottle you can leave just like that or tie a ribbon or a bow or you can even paint it and while allowing it to dry don't keep the bottle in a sleeping position keep it in a standing position so our simple and easy bottle art is ready here are some videos and photos of the bottle art Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching.